Let's look ahead to the regular season. How many Jets receivers will have at least 700 yards receiving? I think the over-under in the Bet MGM studio is two and a half. I'm going under, but I think there's going to be a lot that are right there at 700. Let's take a look at the wide receivers, EA. You could make the argument that this unit is the most improved on the team. You could, and I'm not going to argue about that. You can make the argument that this is one of the most improved position groups in the National Football League. The Jets were decimated by injuries last year at wide receiver. In fact, their two leading receivers were slot players, Jamison Crowder and Braxton Berrios. Joe Douglas went to work in the offseason, starting in free agency bringing in Corey Davis and Keelan Cole. And then the Jets were absolutely thrilled early in the draft in that second round when they were able to get Elijah Moore out of Mississippi. Well, you mentioned Corey Davis. He joined the Jets in free agency, and I think the Jets think that they found themselves a number one. Big addition, literally and figuratively. Six foot three, 209 pounds, 65 catches in two of the past three seasons with the Tennessee Titans. Nearly got a thousand yards receiving for the first time in his career last year, 984 yards in all. Average 15.1 yards of reception. What you like about him, a physical, pres a physical presence. He can get down the field and he can catch the ball when he is in traffic. You know, I'm excited to see this revamped wide receivers core in training camp, but particularly for me, it's Denzel Mims. He's built similar to Corey Davis. He has 4.38 speed. I think we forgot about that. He flashed last year down the stretch, but we didn't get a chance to see him in training camp. So that's my piece, but do you have a particular player you're excited to watch? Yeah, well, you mentioned Mims, 6'3", 207 pounds. He's built just like Corey Davis. And he averaged 15.5 yards to catch last season. So both those guys averaged more than 15 yards of reception. And like you mentioned, Mims only played nine games last season. The guy I have my eyes on is Elijah Moore. You think about what he did in eight games at Mississippi, nearly 1,200 yards receiving, 5'9", 178 pounds. He can line up inside. He can line up outside. He had 86 catches last year. Eight touchdowns got in the end zone. And what we saw early at rookie minicamp anyway is that he's already established a very good connection with rookie quarterback Tickles. And you love to see that. And for your full coverage, stay right here on NewYorkJets.com.